I met Sephiroth as he was heading for Shinra Manor, and he acted like I wasn't even there. Busy, I suppose. Hmm? Sephiroth? Ah, I did see him leave a little while ago. Don't know what bee got in his bonnet, but the man was not in a good mood. Looking for Sephiroth? He just left, I'm afraid. Maybe he needed some fresh air? So, how was the reactor? Did you find out what was wrong with it? Looking for Sephiroth? He just left, I'm afraid. Hmm? Sephiroth? Ah, I did see him leave. Haven't heard anything about the reactor either. What happened up there anyway? Haven't heard anything about the reactor either. What happened up there anyway? He's holed up inside the mansion. Something's been off ever since he came back from the reactor. Too much exposure to Marco. We ought to bring him some medicine. Shinra Manor was the biggest building in town, and older than the reactor. The company used to conduct research there, back when they were still a small manufacturer. Even so, the rent on that plot was basically what kept the village afloat. Well, here we are. What now? I mean, the whole place is pitch black. You think he's sleeping or something? A little Mako poisoning isn't gonna hurt a living legend.
took a look around the place, but Sephiroth was nowhere to be seen. to me too. Doubt anyone in the village had a clue. from a 2,000-year-old rock layer, a life form in stasis. Professor Gast named this life form Genova. M-E-G-L-77-1977. Genova, verified as an ancient. M-E-G-L-913-1977. Genova project approved. So, they named the life form Genova. And once they understood what she was, they grew ambitious. Hey, Sephiroth. What you got there? Leave me be. And that was it. He stayed holed up in the basement. Reading, reading, like a man possessed. Got Genova. A locked reactor door. The name of Sephiroth's mother. An ancient. Ah, screw it. Racking my brain's not gonna get me anywhere. May as well just ask the guy. the most fascinating passage. The specimen found in strata dating back 2,000 years smiled with what could only be described as ethereal grace. Though the truth eluded me at first, I later determined that she was an ancient, or a steward of the planet, as they are referred to in legend. She needed a name. And so I dubbed her Genova. The Genova project was approved soon after. A bold initiative to resurrect the long dead ancients. An initiative that resulted in my conception. Or rather, my creation. The crowning glory of Professor Gast. Wondrous experiment! He created you?
I should go. Mother is waiting. Hey! Hey! Hold on! I keep asking myself, why couldn't I have come too sooner? If I had, maybe I could have saved the village. Or tried, at least. What? Hey, you! Get in there! The villagers need your help!
Hang in there. You're gonna be okay. Don't worry. I got you. Come on. Let's get you up. I followed Sephiroth all the way back to the reactor. Dad and I had gone there to hide. When Sephiroth showed up, Dad decided that he was going to confront him. Dad! It was Sephiroth. Wasn't it? He did this, didn't he? <laughs> Sephiroth. Soldiers. Mako. Shinra. I'm sick of this. I'm sick of all of this! <laughs>
I was ever trapped or in trouble. who robbed you of the planet. Your planet. But there's no need to be sad, Mother. Because I'm here for you. Now and forever. You killed my mom. You killed Tifa. My village. My home. <laughs> they were mine by right. This planet too. For I have been chosen. I believed in you. No. Not you! Whoever the hell you are! the last thing I remember. The rest is a blank. The hell it is? What happened? It was all over the news. I remember watching it with my mom. They said he went missing during a training exercise. But then, the story changed. A couple days later, they started reporting that he was killed in action. Yeah, that was it. The news outlets are nothing but Shinra mouthpieces spewing propaganda. Only dumbasses believe that shit. Question. Does that make me a dumbass? Uh, I didn't say that. What I meant was... Screw Shinra for manipulating honest folks. It doesn't matter what they said back then. Sephiroth was in Midgard. We fought him. Whatever happened, he's alive. Don't know about alive so much as... Around? But why come back now? After five years, doing who knows what? Because he wants to finish what he started. He wants to reclaim his birthright and rule over the planet with Genova at his side. After five years? Not to sound like a broken record, but... It's really bothering me. Well, what's bothering me is all this Genova stuff. Excuse me. Guess the travel or something really did a number on my back. Feels as stiff as a board. Let me take a look. Mm. Ah! Wow. 
Wow! You weren't kidding, were you? Let's get you back to the room. Yeah, let's just call it a night. No amount of guesswork will get us any closer to the truth, so how about we give our heads a rest? Oh, no, you don't. That bed's mine. Sweet dreams. See you tomorrow. Hey, Aerith? You awake? Barely. Why? Was wondering... What's Cloud been doing these past five years? Where's he been? And you're... asking me this? Just had a feeling you'd know. Probably did, at one point. All that stuff was taken from me, though. Or... maybe erased? By whispers? Yeah. Maybe that's why. Why what? <sighs> this is gonna sound crazy, but as far as I know, Cloud was never in Nibelheim five years ago. Cloud, you up? Sorry, did I wake you? Nope. What's going on? Oh, uh, it's nothing, really. There's just something I need to ask you. So, can we talk? Sure. Great, but not here. Follow me. Pardon me, sir, but you don't look very well. An old war wound acting up, perhaps? If so, I can certainly empathize. I myself fought for the company once upon a time, and my bodies never let me forget it. It's been a good many years since I served, but still feels like yesterday. Might I suggest retiring to your room for the evening? It's been a good many years since I served, but still feels like yesterday.
Do you think Midgar's over there? Anyway. There's something I need to ask you, too. Shoot. That night, five years ago, at the reactor, I saw you lying there. Saw your wound and all the blood. I figured it was too late. Yeah? <sighs> Wait, what are you implying? That I died? That I'm some kind of imposter? <sighs> Can't believe I'm having this conversation with you. But here we are. Here, look. My scar, that proof enough? After you left, Zongon found me. He's the one who brought me to the clinic. He risked his life carrying me out of the reactor and down the river. Wasn't just him, though. There's the doctor who operated on me all night, and the nurses who looked after me for days on end. I'm here now because they were there for me then. And where were you again? In fact, where have you been this whole time? For five years! You know I can't tell you that. Of course you can't. Sorry, I just need some space. changed but I guess I was wrong guess so I was so happy to see you again but maybe I shouldn't have been to fight. No. We have enough problems as it is. Copy? Night. Tomorrow is another day. What's this? A gift from our humble establishment. Though it may not look like much, it should help you to break the ice with those you meet. Queen's blood?
Of course, this is only the most recent in a series of crises. Multiple reactor bombings, followed by the fall of the Sector 7 plate, culminating in this unprecedented destruction caused by a massive tornado which swept through Sector 0, 1, and 2. After a briefing with Shinra investigators, Mayor Domino released a statement. I need to keep this place looking spick and span. Don't want to concentrated by the infamous... Especially after he Good morning, sir. I must apologize for not introducing myself to you earlier. I'm Broden, the owner of this inn. Your companions have all stepped out. Oh, but Barrett left a message he wanted me to pass along to you. You missed roll call, soldier boy. Luckily, you're on leave for the day. Don't waste it, though. Get your equipment checked ASAP. Sound advice? Perhaps a trip to the arms dealer is in order? Good idea. By the way, Cloud, do you have any folios on you? Yeah. In that case, you might also want to pay a visit to Magnata Books. They have stores all over, but the first official one was built here in Calm. And their resident scholars are remarkably talented. If you want to unlock the true potential of your folios, you should go see them. The first customization is always free. Calm's a simple but beautiful town. Take your time. See the sights. Finally. Rough day yesterday, huh? You've been waiting for me? I've been waiting for a chance to thank you properly. Without your help, I'd still be in Hojo's clutches, trapped in that lab. Was nothing. Even so, I owe you a debt until it's paid. I'm going to accompany you. Oh, uh, if you're getting your equipment checked, have them check mine while you're at it. Sure thing. It's got a backbone. kind of off doing their own thing. I noticed. Say, uh, this tank remind you of anything? Looks kind of like the water tower in Niwon. Right? Weird to think how much it meant to me back then, when I was still there. This is such a quiet, peaceful town. Feels a little weird to be taking it easy, though. You know why Rufus had to step up, don't you? Everyone's saying it's because of Look who it is. You up already? Drinking already? Huh. No, sir. Not gonna have a drop till Seventh Heaven's back up and run. First one's on me, okay? Now that's what I'm talking about. Gotta remember to order some top shelf stuff in that case. Got a long road ahead of us. Better make sure you're prepped for the journey. Don't go buying any souvenirs, you hear? They'll just weigh us down. 
got a long road ahead of us. Better make sure you're prepped for the journey. Welcome! New around here, I take it? Caused by a massive tornado which swept through sectors 0, 1, and 2. After a briefing with Shinra investigators, Mayor Domino released a statement declaring the tornado to be, quote, weather warfare perpetrated by the infamous insurgent group known as Avalanche. The administration also suggests the investigations into the matter. She's late. Too late. Or am I here too early? Maybe I got a little carried away with this whole proposal business. This Mako tank allows us to. I want to call up the clock tower next. I hope they catch those apples. I am Baron Kyle here. The towering wall that I have built. The I hear Midgar's. Are Welcome. Damn, that is quite the weapon you got there, mister. Seen plenty of action by the look of it. But saying that, it's still only a shadow of what it could be. With a little love, that baby will sing. If you like, I could show you. See? what I tell you? That girl is singing, and she's got the voice of an angel. Just make sure you take proper care of her, all right? Oh, and while you're here, check out what we got to offer.
take care of that weapon now. Or is Broden not doing so well? What are you doing here anyway? Standing watch. One can never be too careful with Shinra. I knew I could count on you. <laughs> Flattery will get you nowhere. If you're expecting that. Leave this to me. The call monster. Nothing to report so far. Critical. The Mako outflow from Midgar has stirred up the monster population, making them especially dangerous. Leaving I want to see the wind! Sure thing, son. I was thinking of giving it a try myself. <laughs> 